Yo, 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 what's up, what's up, what's up? It's your boy Young D right here. Welcome back to another episode of Young D's Kitchen. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below. If you already subscribed, much thanks. All right, guys, today I'll be preparing a very delicious roast chicken. So just keep back and relax. I'll be back right after the break. As I was saying, today I'll be preparing a very delicious roast chicken. So right here I have three and a half pounds of chicken that I already cleaned up and washed in some lemon juice and vinegar just to cut some of that raw scent out, right? Also I have some seasoning that I went ahead and minced, right? Right here I have some garlic, some scotch bunny pepper, some rosemary, some thyme, onion and scallion also i have some vegetable that i made for stuffing right here i have some carrot some tomato some irish some celery and some sweet pepper and all my herbs and spices i'm going to use so let's get started all right guys so first i'm going to start by poking a couple holes into the thick of part of the chicken right which is the breast just to allow the season to marinate inside the meat properly. I'm just gonna poke a couple of holes. Just in the breast, right? Because the breast is the thicker part of the chicken, so. All right, that will do. First, I'm gonna start by adding one teaspoon of black pepper. Also gonna add one teaspoon of paprika. Also gonna add one teaspoon of Italian seasoning. Also gonna add one teaspoon of Cajun seasoning. Also gonna add one teaspoon of cool running chicken seasoning. Also gonna add one teaspoon of Maggi all purpose seasoning. Also gonna add one tablespoon of minced ginger. Also gonna add two tablespoons of Maggi food flavor seasoning. Also gonna add one tablespoon of dark soy sauce. Now I'm gonna go ahead and add my natural seasoning now I'm gonna go ahead and rub my seasoning inside the meat and guys this is smelling really, really delicious. Trust me. You have to make sure you stuff some of that seasoning in the belly, right? I'm gonna flip it over and make sure I get the back properly. Guys, this is smelling really, really wonderful. Trust me. The aroma that is coming from this chicken is unbelievable. Wow. I take some of that season and stuff inside the belly, alright? Alright, so 
I'm just gonna leave this to soak for about an hour, right? Just to make sure the meat is properly marinated. So I'll get back to you. All right, guys. So after leaving my chicken to marinate for an hour, right? I'm now gonna go ahead and start with the stuffing process. But before I do so, right? First, I'm gonna add one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil just to keep the chicken moist and nice while it's roasting. Now I'm gonna go ahead and rub the chicken with the olive oil, right? So after rubbing my chicken guys, now I'm going to go ahead and start with the stuffing, right? Oh wait, let me get a next gloves. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and start with the stuffing, right? Then I'm gonna go ahead and just tie the foot, right? Just to keep the stuffing inside, keep it from falling out. And also to help the chicken bake a little faster, to actually lock in the heat inside the, on the chicken, right? So I'm just gonna go ahead and just tie the foot. Keep it like this. And for the rest of the stuffing, I'm just gonna add it in the baking pan, right? Alright guys, so I already went ahead and set my oven to preheat at 350 degrees, right? And I'm just going to place my chicken in the oven to roast for about an hour and a half. Then I will get back to you. Alright guys, my chicken is in the oven for over an hour now. So I'm just going to go ahead and take it out. And this is what it's looking like guys wow wow turn out perfect don't it look at it tell me honest truth not pretty jesus please yo this pretty all right guys so i'm just gonna go ahead right and start to prepare the gravy so i'll get back to you all right guys so now i'm gonna go ahead and get started with the gravy right first thing i'm gonna do is to cut the card that I use on the leg, right? Then I'm gonna go ahead and take a spoon and scrape all the stuffing out. Guys, this here is pure gold, trust me. This is gonna make one of the best tasting gravy you will ever taste, trust me. Alright, so after getting out my stuffing, I'm just gonna go ahead and take my chicken out, right? And just rest it in the next container. Alright. And all this juice and everything, I'm just gonna scrape it in a pot. Just cut some water in it, right? I'm just gonna rinse out that little excess of season that left back, right? Alright, guys, so first I'm gonna start by adding one tablespoon of honey. Oh 
also gonna add two tablespoons of tomato ketchup. Also gonna add one tablespoon of lemon juice. Stir it a bit. Now I'm gonna go ahead and place it on the stove to boil until it becomes thick. All right guys, so I'm just gonna go ahead and show you what it's looking like inside. All right. Wow, lovely, right? Look at this. Nice. Wow. This is the finishing product of my roast chicken. Oh, look. Look delicious, right? Tastes delicious too. I wish y'all be tasting this right now. Wow. Nice. All right, guys, I'm actually serving it to some rice and peas, corn, and steam veg. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do a little taste test for y'all. Mm. Guys, mm -mm. guys, I, I, I'm tasting heaven right now. Trust me. Wow. Mm -mm. This bag. Trust me, this bag. Mm. Flavorful. Yo know guys, I finished this off camera, so I will see you next time. Mm. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, comment and subscribe to my channel. Just hit that notification bell below to keep up to date with all the latest videos each and every week. So until then, take care, I'm out.